Guinness is one of the most recognizable beer brands in the world. But I bet there are a lot of things you don't know about the good stuff. Guess which part of the world is the biggest consumer of Guinness beer outside of the UK? If you guess North America or Australia, you need to start thinking a little bit more outside the box. Oh. Approximately 40% of all Guinness is sold in Africa. Nigeria in particular just can't seem to get enough of the black stuff. That's another thing. You might be able to order a pint at a pub simply by saying, Give me the black stuff. But the nickname is actually quite inaccurate. The true color of Guinness beer is deep ruby red. I bet you didn't know that Guinness has an elite panel of experts who taste and vet every single batch of beer before it leaves the brewery. So where do I send my resume exactly? Guinness is brewed in Dublin at the St. James Gate Brewery, one of the largest breweries in the world. How much do you think the company pays for rent each year? Hundreds of thousands of pounds? A million pounds? More? Try 45 quid. That's about $65 a year to produce beer for a multi-billion dollar company. Why is the rent so ridiculously cheap, you ask? Get this. In 1759, Arthur Guinness signed a 9,000-year lease with the landowner at a fixed price of 45 pounds a year. Well played, Arthur. Well played. In Ireland, doctors used to prescribe Guinness to pregnant women. Because the creamy stout is rich in iron, something that expected mothers need 50% more of in their diets. To this day, it's not unusual to see nursing mothers drink small amounts of Guinness to increase their milk supply. Guinness is good for you, right? Guinness is actually considered to be an aphrodisiac in some countries, including Nigeria, where it's marketed as liquid Viagra. Arthur Guinness, the man behind the stout we tout, fathered 21 children with his wife Olivia. Can you imagine being pregnant for two decades, ladies? Olivia, you are a powerhouse. Do you have any other weird facts about Guinness beer to share? Let me know what I missed by leaving a comment below. And be sure to subscribe to my channel while you're at it. Thanks for watching, and bottoms up!